I'm Chris Winters. I live in Saranac Lake and I'm an artist here. Um, I have been part of the studio tour for probably eight years and it was uh, coordinated by various people, started by the Adirondack Artists Guild. The artists are demonstrating their work, showing how they do everything from doing a pastel painting to fiber collage like I do. Um, there are potters on the tour. There are people working with um, drawing materials, various kind of drawing media, lots of painters, um, other people doing collage work. So lots of different kinds of art mediums and many different ways the artists want to show you what they're doing. We want the artists to benefit, we want the community to, develop, to benefit as well and sort of develop those relationships that make us be a stronger art community. And we'll get a magical print. Bam! Oh! <laughs> well, my name is Margaret Mahan, and I'm the co-director and co-founder of Peace Paper Project. And um, what Peace Paper does is we, we sort of combine paper making as social action with paper making as art therapy. And we believe that the clothes that we wear all sort of they tell a story. Um, you know, the experiences that we have in the clothes to some extent can be bound up in those clothes. And so when we cut them up and pulp them and make paper out of them. We can uh, recreate the story, or we can transform it, or we can just share it in another way. The way that we're able to make this all work is that we have this machine called the Hollander Beater. It was invented in 1680 in the Netherlands, that's why it's the Hollander Beater. Um, and the way that it works is it has this bladed roll, it kind of looks like a paddle boat wheel, but with hockey skate blades on it and underneath the roll there's a bed plate with knives and over the course of um, you know 30 minutes to several hours this this bladed roll will spin and it will circulate water through this basin and in the water we add the fiber and so basically what this wheel does what these blades do is they pound the material to a pulp the actual technology hasn't really changed much since 1680 but the difference is that we've modified ours to be portable I'm Jacqueline Altman. I'm a watercolor painter and a member of the Adirondack Artists Guild in Saranac Lake. And I'm participating in uh, the, Adir the artist tour, the Artists at Work uh, studio tour. Uh, I've been involved with it since the very beginning. And it's wonderful to see it continue and be successful. And there are quite, I think there are at least 25 or 30 people today that are open and uh, this is the first time that we've had the studio tour on a summer day. Usually it's the end of uh, September. So we're trying something new and hopefully it works. <laughs>